Hello everyone, this is how to make raw vegan coconut kefir yogurt. Kefir is just another word for saying cultured, like cheeses and yogurts and I don't really know what kefir means. Anyway, go to Chinatown, go to an Asian market, get yourself some coconuts because regular stores oftentimes will not have coconuts or you can harvest them from someone's yard. Okay. Here is some stuff you can get from Chinatown. This is just to show you how cheap it is to shop at an Asian market or Chinatown. It's a lot cheaper than your regular store, and you can get different kinds of stuff. You'll need coconuts, preferably young. You'll need some kind of culture. I'm going to get kefir grains because you can reuse them. Some way to heat the yogurt because it needs to be at a certain temperature. Sugar to feed the cultures. A blender to blend everything up. And you could have a positive attitude if you want. I don't know. If you want to be negative, then fuck you. Anyway, get on with your life and put a date into the blender and freaking mix it up, brah. Because you need some kind of sugar. That's coconut water to add some liquefaction to it. Because it needs to be the right consistency. Actually, it doesn't, but whatever. Just figure it out. Put some whatever amounts of whatever inside that you want. I used a little bit of coconut water. Just, just make it, bro. Just make it. Just go to your blender right now. And just start making it, bro. Now, um, okay. It's blending up. Beneficial bacteria. Good for your colon. Good for everything. Good for plants. If you can look up compost tea, that's what this is. But it's for your body and not for plants. It's like... You're creating bacteria and you're just supplementing yourself with it. It's also used in hydroponics. They use beneficial bacterias and other things of that sort to keep their plants from getting moldy roots and stuff because the plants grow. And it's a lot better than sterile hydroponics. You can look that up too, is beneficial bacteria hydroponics. It's like, um, yeah. Anyway, here's the almond yogurt. I'm going to add it to the, the mix to add some culture. Make sure it's not pasteurized because pasteurized means dead. And if you eat pasteurized, you're going to be dead sooner than you think. Put that in there. That's adding life to it. You're putting... Did you know that your body is more of a host of life? This is the old yogurt, by the way. Your body is a host for life more than you are alive. The the human body hosts more things, bacteria, species inside of you than there are people on this planet. So, yeah, you've got parasites in you too, probably. Okay, here's the consistency of it. It's pretty much the same as regular yogurt. Dairy yogurt that you buy from the store. Dairy sucks. I hate dairy. It makes you slow. It makes you congested. You know what? As an experiment, I want all of you out there to go and quit dairy for a month. If you can quit dairy for a month, you'll probably be feel really addicted to it, but do it. It'll make you feel better. Trust me. Okay. Here it is in the sun, 100 to 110 degrees. I don't care how you keep it at that temperature, but get it to around there. Leave it there for three to six hours, and it will expand and turn bubbly and be kind of like soda, like Sprite. If you open the jar, it will do this, splatter all over, and it, actually it exploded because of the gas, and blow all over the ki kitchen and shit. And you'll have to clean it up. Here's the finished product. Honey, all over the place. Sorry for yelling, but no, actually I'm not sorry because this shit is the bomb! And I like using a lot of honey on it. Okay, here's a salad. I made some green curry with it because I don't like canned coconut milk because canned coconut milk has sulfides in it turns into a mummy and it's bad for you it makes you have a beer belly look it up okay here's some green thai curry paste stuff that i mix it i also put ginger and other things lime juice and all kinds of fresh stuff and i got creative and that's what i want you to do be creative in life in recipes just mix shit together create your own recipes be creative like this outro that I made, being creative, and I got it for free, just like I got everything else for free in life. Because everything's free. Life's abundant. Okay, have a great day.